boy who is King Sean, and we back again with another classic. You know, on this channel, we talk about finance, we talk about credit, we talk about anything to take you and your family to that next level. So we're gonna talk about today three things that Navy Federal will not tell you, and they're not gonna send you emails about these things. Now, the first thing, we're gonna get straight right to it because it's three good ones. The first one is that once you approve for one of their credit cards, which I have three of their credit cards, um, you know, every six months. You could call in or they automatically uh, give you an increase. So now what I did on my one of my first cards that on my fifth month, I called in. This is how I got them. I called in on the fifth month. I asked them for an increase. They gave me a $5,000 increase. So on the six months came around, it the computer automatically generates if you be able to be approved for increase or get denied. So they approved me for an extra 3000 on the six months. So in that 30 day window, I got an increase of 8000 Now, like I said, it's a small percentage that people do this because nine out of 10, you're going to get denied. You got to wait to that six months so the computer could generate to see if you could get an increase or you not get an increase. That's something you need to know. I actually got a, a close friend of mine that said he got it at four and a half months. He pulled the trigger and on a six month, they gave him another increase. I think he got a total of like a $10,000 increase in like 60 days by doing this little, um, doing this little hack. Now that's number one. Number two, the number two thing is that a lot of people don't know. You might be waiting for your six months and guess what? You might not get an increase. It might say denied. You might request it. might say denied. You don't know why. Nine months went by, a year went by. You still can't figure it out why. Do you know why? Do you know why? <clears throat> because your credit card might have an automatic lock on it. Every credit card company uh, has this. I learned this because this happened on my discovery card two years ago. And I had to find out the hard way <laughs> after going almost a year and a half without an increase. So <clears throat> what happened is, let's say you put a freeze on your credit report because you're trying to restore your credit report. Or the main thing they put locks on your credit increases if that your credit limit is always high. So if you keep your credit limit as always high, they will automatically put a lock on your increases. So when you're supposed to get increased, you'll get denied and you won't get it and you won't know why. Again, you got to stop being lazy, get your ASS up and do the work to find out this information. Get on the phone because it's two in the morning right now. I told you I'm going to be doing videos back to back. This is my fourth video for you. I ain't moving from this chair. I'm working. I'm trying to get y'all this information. So you need to get on the phone and you need to ask that customer service, do you have a lock on my credit card for automatic increases? And if they do, you need to get it removed immediately. So that's number two. Number three is another good one. And this is one that you're going to need because right now with inflation, prices going up, gas prices is, is crazy right now. Milk is at $7. Cigarettes is going to be $15 soon. I don't know. It's getting crazy. So the number three thing is that every one year of your anniversary with Navy Federal, with that credit card, you could call them and ask them to reduce your APR. I have done this once already. I'm coming up on my uh, with two other my credit cards, I'm going to be doing the same little hack right here. Not really a hack is this information knowledge that you need to know. And if you know, I'm here to let you know, call them up, get them on the phone, customer service, let them know you are at your one year anniversary. I would like to reduce my APR rate. Um, when they did mines, they dropped mines 2%. Um, hopefully when I do my other cards, it'll be 2% and every year on, I'll keep dropping it to get it, um, low as I can, man. So these are all these little hacks that you need to know, man. You need to, uh, information you need to know. I'm here to give y'all it. Um, after this video drop, you get on the phone with these customer service and you do these three things I just told you, I need you to get in the comments and let me know what they said. Let me know what they did. Did they, did you get something positive? Did you do it? Did you? Did you have a lock on your credit report and they got it removed for you? I need to know. Let me know. Cause I really, I'm really curious to see. Uh, I've been getting a lot of people I'm doing one-on-ones with. I told them to do this, uh, this past week, two people told me they did have locked and they did get it removed. So now they'll be able to get the increases. One guy said he'd been with Navy Fredder for two years and then get an increase and he had a lock and never know. And again, these are three things that Navy Federal will not just pick up the phone and call you. They will not send you an email. These are things when it comes to having knowledge that you should know. Again, information is powerful. 
Peace, Pooh. I love y'all. Like, subscribe, comment. But for now, I'm up out of here. It's 2 o'clock in the morning. I need to go get some sleep. This is my last video. Peace.